So this is my magic room, my witchy room, starting from the front door. It's my living room. It's a mess right now, to be honest with you, but... So I figured we'd explore it. So first up, this is my healing altar. And second, this is my mini altar. This is my, uh, I don't know what you'd call it, but it's my skeletons and skulls. And then we'll move over. This is my wall <laughs> my first area with my rock cabinet my apothecary cupboards my blessing jar my skull candles my book of shadows propane for my lighter my bricks to crush and all kinds of stones These up here are all my divination tools from my pentacle, I mean, <laughs> pendulum board to all my cards. And this is some more stones, my black mirror, my collection of witches, my crystal ball, my collection of witches I am so proud of. And we'll move on to this cupboard. This is a magical box. My beautiful salt lamp my daughter got me. And this cupboard is for items that I use for my Etsy store. And then my sticks, which are rose stems and belladonna or nightshade stems. My rattle. My rain stick, my witch's broom I made, my witch's balls, and a fortune telling scarf, which I thought was adorable. My stuff on the walls, my oil cupboard, my magic box we just made. This is a bookcase full of goodies, my mirrors. This little cupboard I use for candles. Then I'm going to use spell candles, my herb knife. This is a, a globe. And this is Rosie. This is my mama right here. And more of the bookcase. And this is an herb and tincture cupboard. All my goodies. Herbs are full. I don't have any more room for herbs. I've got some things sitting down here. This is more of an herb cupboard. Has herbs in it. Just all kinds of goodies. Uh, right here is all my journal books and my necessity books. The ones I use most often for my herb work. Some toadstools, my tea pot, and then down on the shelf, have my incense and jars, my roses, and my wasp nests, 
which I have many of. And we go this way, and we'll come to a little table. It's not really much, just a table, but it's got a basset corner. And back to another herb cupboard. So up on top are my lanterns. And then oils that I make. And then herbs. Jars that I use for my Etsy shop, my cauldron, my driftwood, and then empty jars. And this way we have my Hecate altar with my Buddha picture. This Hecate altar also serves as my candle cupboard. They're full of all kinds of candles. You can see that I, I stay in stock. Over here we have my sea altar and my cursing altar, my little fireplace, and then my ancestor altar, which I didn't give you much time for, my messy bookcase, and then my workstation. This is my working altar. Uh, this is a journal I'm going to start, a new one. This is one I'm almost finished with my coffee, and all my mortars and pestles. So if you have any questions about certain items or that you've seen or certain things you'd like to comment on, uh, just let me know. It's my beautiful moon. Uh, just let me know. I'd be happy to answer any questions. I hope you enjoyed the little tour. And I will talk to you soon.